back to my channel i know it's been a while so i decided to come on here and um just dye my hair i'm bored this quarantine life is really crazy i look like a hot mess because like i've been i ordered my dye april 8th i want to say and today is the 17th i think anyways but um I just wanted to get a video out for you for you guys just something for you guys to watch um i bored my hair so i'm going to dye it um i'm actually going to dye it red and it's i'll show you guys in a sec but um i just want to say like i hope everybody out there is staying safe um social distancing themselves um i hope that everybody is um just trying to keep clean Wash your hands anytime you come from inside outside um what else and just quarantine yourself stay inside as much as much as you can also trying to find things that occupy you um find things to like uplift yourself in this hard time um i also want to say that like do things that make you happy while you can um we don't know how long we're gonna be home for um, I hope that it's not long because I really want to go back to work. Um, just It's just bored being in the house. But yeah, just find stuff, something that just uplifts yourself. Find something that like you've been always wanting to do and never had the time to do it. And this is the, now the perfect time to do it. Um, so yeah, I'm going to get right into this dye. I had to take off all my jewelry, but I just want to show you guys the dye um that i use so i actually ordered from sally's beauty i always order my dye from sally no, not order but like when i'm dyeing my hair it's always from sally's so i have the sally the salon care but anyways this is what i use um i just got the small bottle just because i don't dye my hair that often so that's okay um also for dye i already put it in the container the bowl whatever it wants to be called so i already put it in but i always use high color l'oreal and this is the color red and i use two magentas i just want to make a quick pointer that like i'm not a professional i do this myself or my mom does hair so i go to her but since in this whole quarantine thing and it's not the first time i dyed my hair myself tell you the honest truth like this is probably like my fifth time dyeing my hair myself but um i always use high color l'oreal since the first time i used it and i got the results that i wanted i just said that like okay there's no point of trying out different dyes when i know that this works really good for my hair and i seen on other youtube videos that like this is the best brand or kind of dye for like dark hair and i just want to say that like it's true because I never have to like re-dye my hair within a couple of weeks the dye lasts a really long time um yeah i just always make sure that like after i dye my hair i always use good moisturizer deep condition um products that i use is always moisturizing just to keep my hair strong and healthy i'm gonna get into dyeing my hair before Naya does wake up so what i'm gonna do quickly i'm just gonna explain to you guys i am gonna do the ends of my hair first and then I am going to let it sit for probably about 10 to 50 minutes. Um, before I forget, this is the dye. It looks like a lot, but I do have a lot of hair. And I am dyeing my hair from fresh. Like my hair, I dyed it jet black. So this is starting from fresh. If I don't use it, I always end up just throwing away because I don't dye my hair that often. Like I said before, I probably dye it like once a year, even if. So I'm going to go ahead and you guys just sit back and listen to some music. So I am completely finished. 
I don't usually do this myself. Well, the last couple times I don't have the last one time I haven't done it myself because I am very, very, very messy with dye. As you can see, I even like got some on my face and like everywhere I didn't want it, but I tried to coat my hair as best as I possibly can. I carried it way farther than I expected, but. I guess that's whatever, but like it got really messy. I am so mad because it kind of stained my carpet. I'm really, really mad because I know it's not gonna come out because it's dye, first of all, and it is red dye. But I'm just gonna show you the 360 here, really quick. I'm gonna put it in pink tails, put um, a garbage, a plastic bag over it, and then I'm gonna put my shower cap just to get some more steam in there with it. One thing I want to say about dyeing my hair, it makes my curls way better. Like it gives me more definition. I don't know, it's more, it's weird to me, but and my hair feels so good afterwards. But I'm just gonna show you this really quick. Probably not the best back there, but I don't have anybody helping me. So, okay, so quickly before I go wash my hair, I am going to use the Tresemme um, Biotin um, Repair 7, I mean, plus 7. So it's like 7 in 1 different benefits to it. So it's um, blow drying, bleaching, brushing, straightening, coloring, braiding, and curling. Um, um, and this is the shampoo, same exact thing. I bought these a really long time ago, but I really like how it feels in my hair. Like, it just feels so good after. And then, whoops, you guys have seen this before on my channel. It's not the first. It's still Aurea. Um, I'm gonna use this. This is a mask. Long, damaged hair. My hair's not long. I feel like it's medium length, but it has keratin in plus castor oil. Dream length. I love this, it feels so nice on my hair. My hair feels so super, so I'm gonna use that. And then when I'm all done, I'll come and show you guys the color and hopefully it looks good. Peace. So I washed my hair <laughs> and I um, shampooed, conditioned, and deep conditioned. I dyed my hair just black and I wanna say mid-january so it's been like three months since i dyed it jet black so my roots is mostly burgundy and the ends are like still really dark i feel like it's because my new growth came in and the jet black is on my ends basically only now so the color didn't really take to my ends and as you if you go back in the video you've seen that i did my ends and it's still darker than my roots but anyways oh i have like a red patch right there or it's more red on the camera because it doesn't look like that regular but this is my hair with absolutely no product in it i'm i'm okay with the color like i'm no problem but as you can see like what i was talking about the two and I went in with my ends first, but it's okay. I'm fine with it. I don't have a problem with it. I'll show you guys the products. I just got some new products. But one of them I've already used before for my first ever ever wash and go that I tried. So first is the Garden Your Fruit Style Curl Treat. I literally just went to Shopee Jack Mart and I found it and I'm like, this would be so nice in my hair. And it's a butter, hydrating. It says coarse here. And it smells actually so, so good. So, so good. And then I have the As I Am Curling Jelly. This is what I have tried before and my curls actually are really, really nice. So I'm hoping that like it comes out as good. Look at that. Look at my hair like what the hell? It's just so 
anyways let's get into this video i'm gonna use my favorite as i am leaving grow yogurt <laughs> So I'm all done. I use not that much for the jelly, but because my hair is super, 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 super thick, it the roots is just not agreeing with it. So it's still really poofy at the roof roots, as you can see. Like it's not defined, only on the ends. So I know that when it dries, it's gonna be like really big for the first couple of days um and when it dries the roots are just gonna be frizzy so it doesn't really matter because this whole quarantine thing i cannot get good products so i'm just using what i have and when it dries i'll most likely come back tomorrow and show you guys everything so stay tuned well guys i'm back this is the finished look um I like it the jelly the last time I used it I guess because my hair is more thick now um, the jelly is like it only I don't know how to explain it it like literally only defined my ends so if you can look if you can I don't know how to say this properly on the camera but as you can see like the roots are not as defined as like the end of my hair and Ever since I started taking um, biotin, I used the rice water after I had an Anaya, and it's just like my new growth is like uh, 10 times thicker. So I have to find products that are like really strong holding. So maybe something like Eco Starly Gel or not a jelly. So more like a gel based product would probably definitely define my hair. Um, even though I like this, like my hair is nice and fluffy, um, there's a lot of movement to it, so I'm not, uh, I don't say, like I don't have a problem with it. So I like it, I like my results. You can see the red more like in the middle. So what I might do is probably like, what are we in February? No, we're in April, sorry. April, May, June, July, August, September, maybe around September-ish. Um, I go ahead and dye it again because then like it would obviously grow out. I give myself a good window before I go ahead and dye it again. I don't like wait like two or three months or or like a week or I don't know however long people some people wait but like I wait like a good chunk of time just to like let my hair grow out, let my moisture come back in my hair just so that i know that my hair is not completely damaged and just give myself a good window just to make sure that like um after dyeing my hair my hair is still being treated right and that you know just just to be safe i don't want to damage my curls and yeah so i hope you guys like this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and don't forget to turn on your post notifications so you are notified every single time I post a video because your girl will be back. <laughs> so catch you guys later.